Alrighty guys, so this tree got some really long branches that are grown from the bottom of the tree up that we need to remove. Um, like these two branches you can see right here that are um, just grown from the base, so we'll just cut it around right here. And uh, this branch I will just cut around right here. Um, this way we can keep the, uh, um, once it start back budding, we can get a nice uh, path uh, right there. I'm also removing all these yellow leaves. Um, so um, being a tropical and evergreen, um, you know, the old leaves will be automatically defoliated. And so if you have a evergreen trees of any kind, uh, you know, don't be alarmed when the tree are shedding its uh, older leaves on the inside or on the lower portions as the new leaves are growing because this is uh, a normal process for evergreens. So this lower left branch have grown too long so we'll just uh, trim it back. Uh, this way we can get some nice uh, branching on this uh, on this branch and be more compact. Alright, so the base of the tree, um, this part right here, um, it is a little bit of a mess um, just because um, there are multiple branches coming out on the base and usually you really don't want to do this. Um, just not only is it a, a you know these are sort of bar branches but um, um there is also a possibility that with all these branches being right here you'll get this um swollen uh portions on a trunk that may be uh not very attractive but being how close it is to the uh the the nabari i'm not too necessary to worry about it um but uh, there is that uh, shorter branch, right? the smaller one right there, that we will just go ahead and uh, remove because uh, we don't need that one right there. Um, you can always uh, tuck some of these uh, bar branches to give them a little bit of uh, a uh, different level. Um, so, uh, you know, they're not just uh, parallel to each other's. And so this way will be a little bit more acceptable. On the back, there are also these two branches that we will just remove. Um, the lower one, if you want to, you can sort of keep them as some sort of sacrificial branches, but it's not necessary because we have plenty already. Alright, so taking a look at the whole tree, um, I am going to trim down those branches. Uh, this way, we can have this as the apex and it would be in alignment with the nabari, so it would just go out to the, uh, to the left and then it will curve back uh, to the apex, which is in perfect alignment with the nabari. Um, this would make it more of a balanced and attractive tree. I will also go ahead and trim back that lower right branch, this way we can get better ramifications because right now it's just one long branch. I trimmed back this branch earlier, but uh, I think I will just go ahead and completely remove it. Um, it's just not necessary and it's just a little bit too congested right there. And it is also a younger shoot, but it has thickened up quite a bit, um, which means it is robbing the apex of a lot of the nutrients, so we will just go ahead and remove it. Alright, so I think that looks a lot better. Um, it's just not as congested and we can... Uh, give the tree more uh, space and layering in between. There are all these small dead twigs or branches that we'll go ahead and go in and clean them up.
All right, so let's uh, wire some of these uh, lower branches down to be more horizontal. So those uh, bluish green stuff that are grown on, a, on the trunk, uh, they are lichen and uh, they are for the most part harmless but uh, they really should be removed to prevent any potential damage to the bark. Um, but they do come off very easily with like a brush or something and uh, I'll do that uh, uh, sometimes later. I uh, decided to remove the guy wires on the uh, lower branch here and do a full wiring just to get a better control on the movement um, but uh, to be honest I may just uh, go in and go ahead and remove uh, that branch and the one uh, above it on the, uh, uh, the left side and just keep the one on the right but um, I'll just think about it there's no rush Alright, so I think that's all that we are doing to the tree today. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribed and liked, and I would also love to hear your thoughts in the comment sections. Um, but otherwise, until next time, and take care.